Okay, that up looks good. It's pretty darn good right there. Perfect positioning impact. Head's right back where it started. Hips are nice and rotated. Hands are in front of the club head. You can stay back on that ball. That's a great job. The only thing that could be any better there, on your backswing, you actually want to get behind it just a hair with your upper body. Yeah, right there, you almost stay too much on your left side right there. So your head actually went just a fraction towards the target. Yeah, get get behind it just a little bit first. Okay. Watch your head in that circle. So right now your left ear is right on that left line. All of a sudden right there, see how your ear got a little closer to the target? Okay, watch this. So watch his head when it first goes back. See that? Mm -hmm. Just a tiny little move. It's not a big move. So it's almost a small sway. Yeah, a sway refers to your lower body, okay? Your head should rotate just a hair behind it. So his hips will stay right in between these lines. Mm -hmm. But his chest and his upper body rotate behind it just a hair. See that? It moves about that far. Mm -hmm. You'll see when you do that, you actually move about that far towards the target. Just a hair right there. So at the top of his back when he's behind it. So now he's going to move forward. But when he moves forward, he winds up right in the right spot now. That's where he started. Now he's moving down. Does that generate more power or something? Uh, it can. See, so now you're just a little bit out ahead of that thing. Mm -hmm. See how his back right here? Mm -hmm. Got a very slight tilt behind the ball. And yours has just a tiny little bit of a tilt towards the target. So that's the only thing on that front side that's not perfect. So what that causes is it makes your arms want to go up a little bit too much. No, that's pretty good posture right there. So it goes just a little high right there. So if you rotate behind the ball a little bit better, this left arm is going to wind up just under that yellow line. Now you drop it just a little bit right there. So now look at that thing. It's right in the plane. Went under just a fraction. Much closer than it was before, though. Great job finishing. So we want to get behind it a little bit and flatten it out just a hair. So that that thing lines up right about there. Okay. Then it won't have to drop quite so far coming down. Oh, no, that was pretty close. That was only a hair from the inside. But way closer.